in Texas, we're blessed with well over one million private impoundments scattered across the state. Of course, the bulk of that private impoundment resource is found right here in East Texas. Uh, we typically have between 35 and 55 inches of annual rainfall, and so that's a blessing. But along with that here in East Texas, one of the characteristics of our landscape is acid soils. And so when we have these ponds and impoundments on acidic soil watersheds, that can have a negative impact on the pH of the water. And low pH in water can affect that particular impoundment's ability to produce fish at a maximum level. So one of the things that we recommend to landowners that uh, want to manage their private impoundments for fish production is that they have an annual water test run. All of the county extension agents in the acid soil counties in East Texas have access to these test kits so the landowner simply can pull a water sample and drop it off to their county extension agent to have that water tested. The two major parameters we test in terms of fish production capabilities are pH and total alkalinity. pH is on a scale of 0 to 14 with 7 being neutral and we're looking for a pH range of somewhere between about 6 and 9 for adequate fish production. At the same time, total alkalinity, which is a measure of the buffering capacity of the pond's water, we need a level of somewhere in the 20 part per million or higher range, and that buffers that pond water against wild changes in pH throughout the day. So if you're a pond owner in East Texas, you've got a nice farm pond or impoundment resource there on your property, and you want to manage that resource for fish production, Get a water sample tested every year, and if need be, add agricultural limestone based on the results of those tests to improve the pH and total alkalinity for fish production.